This is how you become a millionaire right this second. First, follow me. Step one, shut your trap about excuses. You need three to 5% to get your first property. 3% of a $400,000 house is $12,000. If you can't save up $12,000, you don't deserve to get a home. That was a little rough. But I worked minimum wage. I worked minimum wage for $5.15 an hour for years. I could save up $12,000 for at $5.15 an hour. So scale one to 10 of me listening to your excuses, zero. Step two. You get the property and then you do a HELOC. I don't live in this house because of RVs. The RVs is just a principle of how I view money and what I do with my money. This house is an accumulation of buying property at the peak of the market when the market's gonna crash over the last 10 years, not listening to your broke brother-in-law, not listening to your parents that don't know what they're doing, not listening to anybody but wealthy people. I ask wealthy, how do you do it? What do they all say? Real estate. Now at the time, I didn't realize the benefits of real estate. I just took action. I delusionally take action. So I buy a property that's overpriced. Years later, it's worth twice as much. I do that again and again and again and again. Notice how I didn't lift a finger to afford this house because of real estate, because of appreciation, principal pay down, HELOCs and all the tools inside of them. Trying to calm down. The reason I get this passionate is I've had hundreds of employees work for me. No feet, no legs. People that have anxiety, that have to knock door to door selling products with their service animal. So every excuse I hear, it's you being acted upon instead of taking actions. You let life act upon you instead of taking action. So instead of complaining about minimum wage, trigger, 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 you work for minimum wage and you still save up. My thousand dollar pair of Yeezys you see me wear, I didn't buy those. A friend bought them for me. Watch all my videos, you see me in my Crocs. <laughs> I don't spend money on stupid stuff unless my wife says so. That's the only disclaimer, that's the only time I blow my money. Miller's Tesla's in the background. This is 10 years of accumulation of taking action in my life. Man